Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2022 Leaf Lumber Baseball. Five box, half case, random number block break number two. Now you often see us use this as a filler for like teams in a, uh, in a group break, in a pick your team break. But this is just five boxes and all random numbers. If there's any redemptions, even if it's a one of one, it'll still go to zero. So just keep that in mind. And I don't think there's going to be this case. We didn't see it in the first half. I don't. I think everything is numbered. But if for whatever reason something is non-numbered, we'll randomize it uh, to one to a person in the group. If there's multiples, like the first one that that first non-numbered card we pull will go to the name on top. The second one we pull will go to the second name. We won't collect them as one big lot. All right. So with that being said. Thanks to this group for making it happen. Appreciate it. We've got Michael, Ed, Nico, Martin, and then Martin Doran. There are the numbers right there. So without further ado, let's roll it and randomize it. One and a six, seven times each. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven, we've got Michael down to Ed. One and a six, seven times for the numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven, we got six down to five. All right, Michael with six, Martin with four, Nico with eight, Michael with zero, Martin with nine, Michael with two, Martin with three, one, and seven, and Ed with five. Let's sort that numerically. And uh, I guess we'll, we'll allow for a little bit of, numbers trading is a little rare, but we'll, uh, we'll see if there's any trades. We'll pause the video, open up the trade window. When we come back, we'll see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the uh, Five box break, so stick around. BRB. All right, hi, welcome back, everybody. So no deals were done, so that number group and names remains the same. So now let's see what we got here. Some, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. We need some slider boxes for some of the, the really thick cards. Four premium cards per box. All game used. Pretty nice stuff. All right, first one out of the gate is Robin Yount. Inducted into the hall in 1999. 25 out of 35. So if you're not familiar with this, with the number block format. Give me a second here, I'll show you. We go by that digit right there. Five, that goes to Ed. So Ed will get five out of whatever, 15 out of whatever, 25, 35, 45, 55, so on and so forth. We got game use lumber, Carlton Fisk. Four out of six. Goes to Martin and the number four. What's great about number block breaks is you don't have to randomize stuff like this. And that triple auto coming up. Lumber lineage, Frank Robinson, Jim Rice, Sammy Sosa. All going to number four, 14 out of 25. That'll be for Martin. This is nice. Triple relic, triple auto. Alex Rodriguez, Rafael Palmero, Jose Canseco. What's it number two? Signature sticks three, and it's three out of five. Wow, that's nice. Out of fives and under, get the train whistle as well. Martin with the number three, and all aboard the Big Hit Express. Nice. 
Next box. Ken Rosal suggesting Rex is saying Judge could switch New York teams next season. Yeah, that's that's definitely been one of the bigger speculated teams that could chase after Aaron Judge's signature. But I feel like that's gonna be that's gonna be the off season right there. Like that leaf has that card stuck right there. Um, I mean, that's gonna be the off season. He's gonna be connected with with every team one way or the other. I feel like. It begins. The speculation season begins already for Aaron Judge. Right. 14 out of 30, uh, Albert Bell. Two pieces of his lumber. Five years, 55 million. First to earn 10 million per year was Albert Bell. A little trivia for you. Martin with the number four. Contract hitter. Game used lumber, Tony La Russa, 44 out of 45. Martin with the number four. Ooh, look at this. Silver Slugger is 1992. Roberto Alomar, Joe Carter, Kirby Puckett, Fred McGriff, the crime dog, Edgar Martinez, Juan Gonzalez, Dwight Gooden, and Gary Sheffield. 15 out of 25. Ed with the number five. That's pretty nice. Yeah, I guess Doc Gooden could swing a little bit too. It's pretty cool. All right, and the fourth one is Billy Herman. Lumber Marks. You got a piece of his bat and you got his cut auto. Hall of Famer, I think Cubs for a little bit. Martin with the number four. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Yeah, I guess I guess he must have won a Silver Slugger award that year. Dwight Gooden. Rex can't see Aaron Judge in a Mets uniform? I don't know. I, the, that's going to be a crazy bidding war for him. But with the new Mets ownership, I think they've been committed to really spending a lot of money. So let's see, a lot of speculation here on the West Coast that the Giants will go after Aaron Judge. Uh, there is, I think there's a, I thought there was a hockey mixer on the site. No, there was, we put a hockey mixer up on the site, but no, no takers on that. So we really don't have any other hockey at the moment. But if you check our Instagram channel at Jaspie's Breaks, there we may have some personal boxes that you could that you can pick up. All right, here's Ted Simmons, inducted into the Hall of Fame in 2020. Ten out of 25, so that goes to zero. Michael, with the number zero. Are they doing utility player silver sluggers now? Yeah, I guess there's more and more players that are that are being deployed as almost utility guys. We got Pete Rose, another one for number zero. 20 out of 35. Big piece of his lumber from Michael. And five out of 30. We got lumber team eight. Andre Dawson, Vlad Guerrero Sr., Marquise Grissom, Pete Rose. And on the bottom, Tim Raines, Gary Carter, Larry Walker, and Andres Galarraga. Nice. And this one here is Brooks Robinson. Five out of 15. 
So that's two in a row for Ed. Signature sticks. Piece of Brooks Robinson's lumber. And his autograph. And a great defensive player as well. Playing the, the hot corner. You found us, Harsh Briar is saying, you found us when we pulled that McDavid RPA. Is that still the biggest hit or has that been topped? That's been topped a number of times, at least value-wise. But I wonder if we pull that McDavid, but that McDavid, that was like pre-pandemic, right? I, I, I wonder what the McDavid would go for if that was pulled now or in the last year or two. There's uh, Gary Sheffield, 7 out of 45 in his Dodgers gear there. Martin with the number 7. Three out of 35, Sultans of Swing. Jim Rice, uh, Don Baylor, Dave Kingman, Reggie Jackson, Dave Winfield, Dave Parker. Martin with the number three. Oh, look at that. You see a little, little, cur a little bit of curvature on that. Game use lumber, Willie Mays, two out of six. That is for Michael. And the fourth and final one is Tony Perez, part of the big red machine, piece of his lumber and autograph, the exemplars, relic and auto. Yeah, Joe, that's another hit where we wonder, like, what what would have that what would that have gone for if we pulled that in the last couple of years? I did see that, Rex. Hopefully, it doesn't deflect back and uh, and end up dooming civilization. All right, final four here. Historical home runs. Eight out of 12. That's a good one. Mike Sosha hitting a home run in the ninth inning in game four, the 1988 NLCS so against, uh, against the Mets. Nico with the number eight gets that dual relic. So what's Mike Sosha doing? You think he gets back into managing? Game use lumber, Greg Vaughn, 23 out of 40. That goes to Martin in the number three. Good for Martin in number three. Here is weapons of mass production. Joe Morgan, five out of 12. Yeah, he can hit. Some stolen bases here, some runs, some OBP. It'll be for Ed and the number five. And the last one here is Fernando Tatis Jr. Signature sticks, four out of 45. Martin with the number four. Not a good year for Fernando Tatis Jr., but still young enough. You can make up for it, right? All right, and there you go, gang. Nice little break here. The um, We got some more. The first half uh, from a fresh case. That's available right now on jazbeescasebreaks.com. So if you want to run this back, I would love to do a nice, fun little break. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next one.